And we're back now with a really big reward for a handy invention at a Chesapeake school. We profiled these students who wanted to make transportation more efficient with school buses, and their hard work paid off big. Then your side's Kara Dixon has this all new tonight. What started out as a simple idea from one of the students ended up winning them $110,000 that not only the school, but the district will benefit from. A trip to compete at the Samsung Solve for Tomorrow competition ended in success for this team from Great Bridge High School. I have been getting, getting some congratulations every now and then. It's, it's a little nice. I mean, it's not like I'm worldwide famous, not the center of attention, but it's nice to get recognition. And a recognition well deserved. Donovan Carter, along with his other teammates, presented their idea, Excel Route, to a panel of judges that they believe will help the bus transportation issues, not only in their district, but eventually around the country. National bus driver shortage is nationwide, so if this is able to be implemented well in our community, there wouldn't be a lot of bar holding for it to impact other communities, and that would be wonderful to see it help other people. The idea came from student Camille Kersha, who watches her little sister after school. One day, her bus was two hours late, leaving her sister outside in the rain. The solution came from Carter, whose dad is a FedEx driver and swipes packages that alter his routes. That created the team's idea to use similar tech that will create the most efficient routes that will help get kids home quicker, freeing up buses, and getting more cars off the road. We're very excited about our app being used. It, we're test driving 100 buses coming this fall, so. We're just really excited to see where this goes, and we just hope it can make an impact. The idea also won them $110,000 in Samsung technology other students in their school will get to use. I mean, we are going to buy materials so we can expand our course offerings in CTE and robotics and electronics. A win-win for not just the school, but the community, and they're excited to see where this will take them. Because of their win, the team will head up to Washington, D.C. later this month to meet their congressional representatives. In Chesapeake, I'm Kara Dixon, 10 on your side.